From the first time I took Ali permit fishing, uh, his mind was blown at the fact that, you know, you could target these fish on the surface, you know, sight casting to them. I always thought that the permit was only a fish that you would catch on a fly rod or on a flat. I like catching big jacks that pull hard, and the permit definitely fits that bill. In this case, you know, we're able to target them using more conventional ways that I'm used to fishing. What are you looking at here, Tony? Well, the wreck's um, right up here in front of us. I think I'm gonna jump up in the tower. Okay. And kind of run around the front of it, and we'll cut the engines and see if we can see something. Coming down here, spending more time with the local guys, I learned that there are other ways to target these fish that are a lot more my speed. You want me to have a crab pinned on ready to go? Yeah, yeah okay. let's get a crab on right now and get ready. I'll, okay. I'll jump up in the tower. There is something about sight fishing permit or even blind casting to them, you know, when you know they're there, that's right up my alley. It's kind of a hunt. You kind of got to track them down. You got to predict which way they're moving and present a bait. So what I like to do is... That was the trick. It was the drill bait. Yes. How put... far in are you going? Mm, not even, you know, a sixteenth of an inch. Is that... You don't want too much meat because you want to pull through when they eat it. Copy. Okay, and that's it right there. Permit are definitely around in big numbers in the spring. They're starting to congregate around these wrecks in bigger numbers. I'm walking fish right now. Yeah, right here. Yeah. And the deal with these guys, right, is as soon as you feel tension, yeah. hit them, right? As soon as you feel it, they're crushing it. It's a great time of year to go out there and target them. So. I got him. There he is. All right, there we go. I felt them crunching it. Crushed it. I think when most people think about permit, you imagine a guy pulling on a flat. But the reality is, this time of year, you know, just before summer, late spring here in the Keys, you know, catching permit from a large center console is very possible, and it's a fish that these guys are targeting. That was them we marked, man. It was them. It was way off the mark, though. And when I brought it up and put it right back out, I got it down like 20 feet. Yeah, but I you think them. about it, they're milling around. They're all over the place. Any concerns with him breaking me off? Or yeah, anything? he's oh. heading towards the wreck, but you, I mean, you're doing the best uh, you can. Yeah, right? yeah. I went button it down too much. It's just one of those things. I'm more concerned about a shark or something. Okay. I mean, I'm, he's owning me right now. Yeah, I'm he's going him. to. I'm mocking him right nice now. Nice work, Tony. They pull, don't they? Oh, dude. Well, they are in the Jack family, aren't they? Yeah, they're a Jack. I mean, that shape and everything, you know, just like reeling up a mahi. They're like sheet of plywood. I see them down there. Got any friends? I don't see his friends. He's on his side. Nice size fish. Yeah, there we go, baby. The beautiful Dude. Florida Keys. So cool. They are such a rad fish. Beautiful fish, huh? So rad. See, and growing up, you Ooh. always hear about the permit, whoa, the tarpon and the bone the fish. size, too. You know? And I was never that excited about catching them because it was just kind of a flats thing, and that doesn't right. get me excited. That, throwing a crab, especially getting to sight fish them, yeah, just an you know, awesome light, fish. Light tackle the whole nine yards. Oh, dang it, Tom. Yeah. That is what we came for, sir. Thank nice you. Nice work, bro. Awesome. Nice work. Hey, on the first stop, too. Man, you're much better at this than Rush. <laughs> Good job, boys. <laughs>